good morning today we are going to discussing another problem in mass transfer gate 2007 extraction it is written on the board you can read that it is desired to reduce the concentration of pyridine in 500 kg of aqueous solution from 20 weight percent to 5 weight percent in a single batch extractor using chlorobenzene solvent equilibrium compositions in terms of end points of a tie line weight percent of pyridine water chlorobenzene are given that is 5950 and 11089 calculate the amount of pure solvent required in kg for the operation so that is what our goal is amount of pure solvent required so again we mark some of the important noticeable first important noticeable points is the solute where solute is pyridine and the total flow rate of the solution 500 kg and our initial concentration is 28% and my goal is 58% so from this to this I want to go with the help of process using chlorobenzene as the now the important thing given to me is these two points and it is written that these two points are exactly the end points of a tie line and if you remember tie line tie line what do we mean by tie line tie line is the equilibrium relationship between the raffinate and the extract if i talk about the distillation then tie line gives me the equilibrium relationship between the mole fraction of more volatile in the vapor phase with the mole fraction of more volatile in the liquid phase extraction tie line gives the equilibrium relationship between the raffinate and the extract and they are in the order pyridine water chlorobenzene pyridine we know is a solute water we know is the carrier chlorobenzene we know is the solvent <coughs> so this is solute carrier and solvent solute carrier and solvent so you can see that solvent is not present that means this point and you can see here carrier is not present that means this point refers to the point of extract and as both are not present I can also make a statement that A and B are completely invisible is not written in this question, but is given by the help of these two points that A and B are completely invisible. Now we are going to make a stage for this question. So let us consider a stage and the inlet to the stage is feed, the feed is 500 kg of aqueous solution in which the initial mole fraction is 20 weight percent so we can calculate the amount of C and the amount of C is 20 weight percent into 500 that means 100 kg and we can calculate the amount of A where amount of A comes out to be 400 kg and we know that So for the solute free basis I need to calculate X0 which is the mass of C to the mass of A that is 1 by 4 <coughs> and let us say this is my solvent coming in this is the raffinate going out and this is the extract going out so raffinate and extract the values are given to me 5950 11089 
weight percent already they are in weight percent so that i can define the value of x1 in the case of refrigerant this is mass of c divided by the mass of a this is the mass of c percent of c and this is the weight percent of a in the case of refrigerant my x1 directly can be written as 5 by 95 in the same way if i go for y1 then y1 can be written as <coughs> c to the mass of b weight percent of c is 11 weight percent of b is 89 in the extract means the y1 will be given by 11 by 89 let us say here the solvent is es here amount of a is rs which is known 400 and here is es and the chlorobenzene solvent is pure so i can take my y not to be 0 balance it is rs x not plus es y not equal to rs x1 plus es y1 this is a simple material balance equation rs is known it is x not is known ES is not known one is known 11 by this equation and that parameter is ES that means the amount of pure solvent which can be calculated as 639 kg
upon es rs upon es now this slope is maximum slope this is maximum and this can be maximum only when my <coughs> es is minimum because it it is actually rs upon es and rs is fixed rs is 800 rs is 800 it cannot change so to for this value to be maximum es has to be minimum so for this slope to be maximum my es has to be minimum equal to i know y2 minus y1 it is 1 by 8 minus 0 divided by 1 by 4 minus 1 by 400 and we know what is rs rs is 800 so we can determine the value of es minimum where es minimum if you calculate it will come out to be 1584 kg per hour thank you